doing well? I received a ton of questions about Microsoft Word. Um, people are looking for some more detail than I went into in my review of Office. So I'm going to go ahead and do that for you guys. And again, this is Microsoft Word 2008. So I'm going to go ahead and open it up for you. So what it does, it pulls up a blank document. And you'll notice this looks very different than Office 2007 that you guys may be using. It looks more similar to Office 2003. It doesn't have the ribbons that 2007 has. So at the top, you've got your typical file information, print, print preview, all your edit stuff, paste, copy, copy to scrapbook, different views um, with views for your toolbox, which I'll show you guys in a minute, things you can insert. You can really insert anything. It's very cool. Uh, pictures, HTML that you've embedded. So if you have an embed code from YouTube, actually paste it right in there and the video will show up. It's very neat. Um, watermarks, kind of anything you want. All your formatting stuff is there. Um, choose all your fonts. It actually shows you what the font looks like in text. You don't just have to guess or select one and then type to see. Uh, some more tools, the source, this dictionary, track changes, all your table information, window, work, and help. Um, and over here is what's called your toolbox. I'll minimize these for you guys here. And um, what this has is all your main controls kind of put in a really easy place for you. This is my font box here. So I've got bold, italicized, strike through, font color, highlight, all that stuff. Um, styles, I can choose different styles. Alignment and spacing, horizontal, all that kind of stuff. Uh, bullets and numbering, obviously it's pretty self-explanatory. Choose your bullets, um, whether you want to indent left or right. Uh, borders and shadings, pretty self-explanatory as well. Uh, margins, control your margins. Document themes, you can choose different themes. Now one really nice feature that Word 2008 for Mac has is this little bar right across the top here. And what it does, if you click it, opens a little strip here that gives you um, just really easy to use templates. So you see cover pages is the first one here. So I have a ton of different cover pages selected. And I can just pick one and uh, it'll open up for me. Same thing with table of contents. Headers as well. And footers, everything that you guys would need to write a paper. Uh, and bibliographies. Quick tables, same thing. A list of more tables and different designs you might like. And using them is just as easy as clicking it. And I'll show you guys in a minute. They have just a ton of charts. Look at that, it's unbelievable. I mean, you can even get this kind of chart. Um, filled radar, it's called. And masked radar. Um, graphics, if you guys need to do org charts or hierarchies. Um, you know, they got it all here. Hierarchy list, target list, pyramid list, and uh, word art. which lets you actually do some art with the actual text itself. It's very handy. So let's go back to all and uh, go to document elements I'll go to cover pages and I'll just pick one for you so let's say I want to use this one as my cover page if I just select it it shows up right here um, and I can just click it and uh, type whatever I want nice and easy uh, quick tables insert quick tables charts um, and again all that stuff so it really makes it uh, nice and handy so let me undo my table I put in here. Um, anyway, it's just a general overview, guys. Word is just like Word on a Mac. Anything you type on your Mac and you send to a PC will open up without any trouble. Um, and vice versa, if you save something on a Mac in Word and try and open it up in Windows, it'll look exactly the same. It's totally cross-platform, uh, which makes things just much easier. Um, you know, I can't speak the same thing for NeoOffice. NeoOffice had some conversion issues. But again, guys, any anything that you're trying to do on a PC in Word will work well with Word 2008. No trouble. And um, you know, back the other way. So just a uh, overview of Word. Hope it was helpful to you guys. And I hope you're doing well wherever you are at. And I will talk to you guys soon. And don't forget to check out the website at www.johnforlakers.com. All right, guys. Talk to you soon. Bye.